Okay, we have a DDR Cedar, and the trunk diameter of this, the DVH, is about 42 to 46 inches. It varies. The tree has a height of about 80 feet. It is towering over the roof. The tree is showing a loss of foliage. The color is good. However, there is a very clear-cut indicator of trunk canker on this tree which shows itself in many places all the way around. I inspected this tree last year and it is clearly worse than it was last year. This is interesting. You can see how the tree bulges and you get little cracks in here. That's an indicator of the, the pressure from this trunk canker disease. And you've got some here and some here. And oftentimes you'll see the, the pitch oozing from all of these cracks. And it's all the way around. It's not so bad on this side, which is the area of the tree that is still sustaining the foliage up there. The client would like to see this tree removed. There's a couple of other factors. This is a house that was rebuilt how many years ago? 2003. 2003, and there's a basement that was not there before? Yes. Is that correct? So they did some significant excavating about uh, oh, 12 feet from the base of the tree as well as bringing in a new gas line. So there's a, a cut that goes straight across here. There's other underground utilities. There was quite a bit of uh, construction impact, which may be part of the reason that the tree is succumbing to the uh, trunk canker disease. So the client is rather concerned that the tree may have an instability associated with past construction damage. And I, uh, I, I can only guess as to what happened down underneath, but if that's so, then it likely is, is showing evidence of the, uh, the root rot or root decay. But the trunk canker is a, is a prominent problem in our area. And um, I see a lot of DDR cedars succumb to this. It's a fairly slow acting disease. It usually takes a few years but it's basically the system is shutting down and you know the the fluids cannot transport to through the tree and they're clogging up and the pressure is causing it to to crack and pour out through the bark so i don't believe this tree is going to last very long but she would like to see it go sooner rather than later